Hello and welcome Grade 12 to the projectile motion task video. Let's start with the questions. Refer to this velocity time graph of a projectile to answer these questions. State whether each of the following statements are true or false. If false, correct the statement. This projectile's velocity is constant. This projectile's acceleration is positive. This projectile's acceleration is constant. The downward direction is taken as positive for this graph. This graph shows the projectile moving downward, hitting the ground and bouncing up. Which one of these graphs represents the acceleration time graph that corresponds to the motion of this projectile? Refer to this position time graph of a bouncing ball to answer these questions. Ignore air resistance. Calculate the height h the ball was dropped from. What was the velocity of the ball the moment before it hit the ground? Time, 0.317 seconds. What was the velocity of the ball the moment after leaving the ground? Time. 0.342 seconds. What was the velocity of the ball at time t? When the ball is at maximum height, time 0 and t, is its acceleration upward, downward or zero? An object is projected vertically upwards at 5 meters per second from the roof of a building which is 830 meters high. It strikes the balcony below after 8 seconds. The object then bounces off the balcony and strikes the ground as illustrated. Ignore the effects of friction. Calculate the velocity at which the object strikes the balcony. Calculate the height h of the balcony above the ground. The object bounces off the balcony at the velocity of 60 meters per second and strikes the ground 18,4 seconds after leaving the balcony. Sketch a velocity time graph to represent the motion of the object from the moment it is projected from the roof of the building until it strikes the ground. When you are asked to draw a sketch graph, you don't have to draw it to scale. The question goes on to tell you the labels you need to include. Let's read these. Indicate. The initial velocity at which the object was projected from the roof of the building. The velocity at which the object strikes the balcony. The time when the object strikes the balcony. The time when the object strikes the ground. Thank you for joining us for this series Grade 12. If you had any problems with these questions, please watch the other videos in the Projectile Motion series. For more help, go to our website. Goodbye.